Welcome to a What I Eat in a Week. As a uni student, I'm back and I'm going to take you through what I eat this week. Last week, I finished my last week of classes and assessments. So this week is just swap back and then next week after will be exams. So I'll just take you through what I eat this week. <laughs> Way too much. Yeah, I just had lunch. We went to this really nice beach cafe near where my soccer game was. I had to get to the soccer game like an hour before it starts because we go through like physios warm-up tactics like ever all of that i'm not sure if i'll stay with the team but i'm so happy i scored a header from a cross in because i don't normally play striker but i was just filling in with the team and was given striker and i it was great except um i'm not i had to leave early so i'm not sure what the score is but i will find out also i was supposed to start the video yesterday but I had coaching so early in the morning, I just could not be bothered. But yesterday, I what did I do? I went out with a friend and we got Japanese bentos. And also, the restaurant was so nice. They gave us free little ice cream filled mochi, which was so good. And they didn't have to do that, so that was really nice. And it was really nice to catch up with this friend because I hadn't seen her in like forever. Hi guys, so today for breakfast, I'm just making coffee and scrambled eggs after i've just got to study a little because it is exam season and then tonight even though it's monday i'm doing like cocktail night with some old co-workers yesterday i finished my book it happened one summer by tessa bailey it was pretty good it was like a really nice light-hearted story so if you're into that it's a really easy light read that's really just nice oh and then yesterday also because i was feeling bored and unmotivated i started reading the cool prince which i also think is pretty good because i like binged akata so i'm kind of on a random reading binge right now so for lunch i'm just making pasta rigatoni is my favorite pasta and it's just really quick and easy though i will cheat and just heat up the sauce in the microwave because i don't really have time to use another pan and heat it up that way but if i do usually i add something like mushrooms or like salami or something to juice the sauce up a little I have work at like in like 25 minutes so I'm gonna eat this as quick as possible overall not too bad I'm back from work we got rained on so that's why my hair's wet and the girls are quite feral but other than that wasn't too bad so I'm gonna have the leftover pasta and then just with pesto just some chocolate lamington probably some sour squirts whatever we have finished the cruel prince so i'm on to the second which is bad because it's exam season i need to stop reading but i'll probably update you and be done with the second book in a few days or a day also just a heads up this is the best it's got like marshmallows like throughout it and nuts and honestly it's so good so I recommend. Pesto is so good. I'm wearing a shirt from Glasses, which is reversible. So I'm just wearing it the warmest way right now. Some tan cargo pants. I'm just gonna wear like Air Forces or something really comfortable. Yeah, I'm gonna do a little bit of makeup. So yeah, Fenty, um, shade, whatever. And a bit of uh, concealer, contour. Tiny bit of like eye makeup if you can see not really
Morning guys, I did not get enough sleep from last night, I'm going to definitely need a coffee today, but yesterday my friends were roasting me for vlogging, I am not feeling the best, but I'll wake up soon so I'll be fine. Okay, I just opened the freezer and look what was on there, it gave me the biggest fry of my life, oh I hate the big ones, I can deal with the baby ones, but Say all the person making money The money rules the world Okay, I have so much to do I have to do heaps today It's been so long since I've seen you Oh my god, I have so much to do I have to make it this I think it's kind of funny The people who died again It is actually so cold today, but we're gonna go drive and get lunch now. Morning everyone, I'm back in the kitchen making breakfast, this time because we've run out of eggs, I'm having avocado toast and coffee. flu injection she gave me a really cute band-aid and so now I'm gonna make lunch I'm just gonna make something really simple because I can't be able to cook so I think I'll make like two minute noodles and dumplings something really like simple I just want something warm and like easy I still need to recover from another love or would you be here? so while I wait for the water to boil I'm just gonna eat this snack I always eat something while I'm cooking because I'm just so impatient lunch dessert before I start studying again. If you're Australian and you buy food from Coles or Woolies, there's like a red cycle sign on the back of packets and that means you can return it to the store so that the soft plastic is recycled and then they make it into like benches or random like other things. So it's a really good way to reduce waste. So I'm gonna eat a few of these and then start studying. This is dinner. This is creamy pesto, pea, mushroom, and asparagus rigatone with a bit of parmesan pesto and just Greek yogurt instead of cream. And it's so good. 
I love adding little things and like veggies to the sauce, so it's really good. We don't have very much to make for lunch, so I'm just trying to be creative. I think it's a little more doughy. The people who died again for the 